Some Fountain County residents are looking to bring some life back to one of the county's historic treasures. News 18's Brad Oppenheim tells us what is being done to preserve one of Indiana's oldest covered bridges. Fountain County is home to three covered bridges, one of which was built during the Civil War era nearly a century and a half ago. Sitting just outside of Attica, the Rob Roy Bridge dates back to 1860. The bridge was closed to vehicular traffic two years ago because of safety concerns, and some residents want to see the bridge back in working order once again. Duncan Gilmore is a member of the covered bridge restoration effort. This bridge is vital. There's a number of people that live back in the road that use the bridge to and from. After deeming the bridge unsafe, county officials obtained an estimate of more than $30,000 to repair the damage. In addition to the three covered bridges, Fountain County has 140 other bridges it's responsible for maintaining. Don Hesler is the president of the Fountain County Commissioners, and he says the money just isn't there to make the repairs right now. We have so much money to try to, you know, to operate, to keep the bridges open, to keep the folks happy, and, and uh, uh, you know, that's what we're in the process of doing. So a group of residents took efforts into their own hands in an effort to restore the Rob Roy bridge. The residents are working on raising money to make repairs. A fund was also created and anybody can donate. They're a beautiful part of the history of Fountain County and to see you know the orange and white barricades placed in front of them uh, you know just really detracts from the beauty of the county. Right now the group is staying optimistic toward reaching their goal. We would really like to get it back in working condition. Reporting in Fountain County, Brad Oppenheim, News 18.